headed back to my safe house and kept thinking about the letter. I know they're trying to manipulate me, but keepers never alter the truth. Just keep it in the shadows. Besides, it's not like I got a lot of leads anyway. If you seek the private knowledge of the sheriff, go to the Eastport Mechanist Seminary tomorrow night. With stealthy discretion, overhear what you may at a certain very timely meeting. Looks like I have something useful to learn from a seminary for a change. There are two open towers and some back doors which might be helpful for getting in. The catacombs below the church could be another way in, but I'd rather not tread where the dead sleep. The meeting will most likely take place in some sort of conference hall. <laughs> There's no guarantee that I'll even be able to get inside, but all I need to do is get close enough to listen at the door. I better pull this off quickly and find a new hideout before the bulldogs get my scent. This situation does have one advantage. Things can't get any worse. Who could hire someone like the sheriff to kill me? Children of Karis were more uh, mild seeming. Thou not the first to be afraid of them, though their visage is wrought to strike terror into the enemies of Karas, or those who might consider becoming enemies. Well, and it might, for it near strikes terror into mine own heart. Thinkest thou thine own soft body of leaky flesh and wheezing gases? is glorious to the eyes of the Builder. Nay, it is thy soul that is the only thing of any worth. So it is with the children of Paris. They are the only thing of any worth. They are the only thing of any worth. Command me, they are the only thing of any worth. As thou sayest, would be well rid of that one. disturb them. I can hear the meeting just fine from out here.
No worry, has he? Lucky fellow! <laughs> Strange you should mention worries, Garrus, because I do have one. It's not that the money's not right, no, it's just that I need to be convinced you've taken the proper precautions. The truant name is untainted by scandal, and I will not be the one to bring it humiliation and ruin. Trust in me, for it is the Builder himself who guides me, and the Baron need never know. Yes. I'm glad your builder guides you, but it would make me feel even more confident if you were to let me in on your whole scheme. Come now, what's the crux of it all, eh, Garrus? Show me what's so special about your new servants. Ah, it is impossible to hide anything from you, good sheriff. I will give the full explanation then in the form of a demonstration. The visual in this instance would far surpass any verbal elaborations I could relate, but I must ask thee to step away from the masked serpent, that's right, and meanwhile I will retrieve our volunteer, a most unfortunate gutter snipe who waits just outside. Come, come, gentle beggar, and stand thee just there, next to the masked man. All is in readiness, so keep thine eyes on the new arrival, whilst I signal the servant, Dusty. My word! The mask emits a red vapor! Continue thy observations, Truett. But it consumes them! We are in peril! Fear me not, Stag Sheriff, for we are safe at this distance. See, already the reaction ceases. They are gone! And what remains in their stead? Sand? No. Rust. Indeed, tis very much like rust and harmless once settled. Brother Fegan, I pray thee, do sweep up what is left of those two. Yes. A weapon, then! Quite fantastic and monstrous. Of course, you'll keep these servants you're making away from me and my men. I need not even ask. Then we are in agreement. You need subjects for your servant project, and I can supply them. Vagabonds, street scum, prostitutes, those who will not be missed by anyone of consequence. They'll be rounded up, charges invented, etc. Still, there's always risk. So I will give you 20, no more. For your part, you'll remember to keep our transactions absolutely secret. And, of course, deliver my payment in advance, in full, tomorrow. I don't trust you, Karras, so you'll receive the subjects only after I confirm the payment. Well, our business here is finished. Yes. Fairly well, Trick. Now see, friends, with the builder's efficiency, I have completed two tasks with but one effort. Firstly, I did secure 20 subjects to be transformed into servants, as you heard. And secondly, I secured the loyalty of the wary Sheriff Tuart. Yes, his loyalty. <laughs> Tuart fears scandal. Yet his actions of late could bring him that or worse, if ever made public. Now, Behold my wax cylinder machine. I've used it to capture the sheriff's very words even as they moved through the air today. Hawking friends. And I can supply them. Vagabonds, street scum, prostitutes, those who will not be missed by anyone of consequence. With his voice thus preserved, Truett dare not betray me or he'll have the scandal he fears so much. Brother Fegan, thou wilt see to it that this wax cylinder machine gets safely to the bank on the morrow. You will find the safety deposit box key in the acolyte's quarters. Friends, we are adjourned. Return now to your duties. 
I'd like to get a copy of that key myself. Strange. I wonder what kind of work the mechanists do here. I could really learn to hate these guys. Better come back here and replace this key when I'm done with it.
conspire and confound me. Calm, friend, calm. On the morrow, let me come by thy workbench and help thee untangle things. I... I would be most grateful, couldst thou help? Tis nothing. Think on it as the copper and tin mingle to make the stronger bronze, so dost we each mingle and flow together in Karis' forge to make stronger as well. Thou art wise. Tis Karis who is truly wise. His bounty and the machines we construct shall help all of humanity in the coming times, and all shall know his wisdom. I will be glad to have this wretched task behind me that I might move to a more profitable position. Dost thou know whether the Sheriff hath arrived? The Sheriff? What doth he hear? In Karis' name, man, hast thou been stuffing leaves in thine ears? Hast thou not heard about the meeting? Oh, the meeting. I had forgotten that today was the date. Fa! Thou hast no idea what I speak on. Thou must learn to pay more attention, lest thee find thyself fallen by the wayside as the future passes thee by. I'm as sure of it as the Builder himself. Oh!
It's no big secret that the mechanists are the ones supplying Sheriff Truart with those machines. These mechanists are just as bad as the hammers. Till I find thee, Salamander.
not in Garrus. From his mouth soundeth the will of the Builder. From his pen the Builder's plan is busily rigged. Woe to them that trust not in Garrus. <gasps> What's that there? In truth, I know not what it was. Hello? Someone there? Ah, silence visits me again. Ah, welcome, friend. Is that thee? <coughs> For the builder's sake, what was that? It was not rats. <clears throat> that I'm sure not in the builder's house. <clears throat> Hello? Someone there?
If someone be there, then bespeak thyself. <clears throat> 